I don't want to cry, so oh, I'm crying. Hey guys, hey my people, welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel, guys. And today I'm going to be basically give y'all a story time on how I truly feel about my dad, my father being dead. Um, this was just like highly requested, like from a lot of people, so. I'm just gonna try to like to be strong, how I be strong sometimes. Um, I'm just gonna fit this in right here. I really do be like emotional every day, but like, it's just an everyday thing to me. Cause like, yeah. So guys, before we get into the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on that post bell notification to get notified every time Shayla posts. And if you are new to my channel, make sure you go to share my video and tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe. Like, go tell them. But anyways, um. I'm just gonna start off with basically just saying let's get straight into this video okay guys so basically I'm not gonna try to make this video long um and before I forgot to say it like before I just take it into the video I forgot to say don't matter my hair y'all know how it be with these dead days like we be trying to stick your head back and then your head curl that's why I do not like my hair so guys um now I'm just gonna say that like me personally I'm a strong person like I do I know I do stuff to making me look weak but I'm really a strong person um I've been holding down for 10 years and nobody never understand my pain like I literally sit in my room all day like you like I know sometimes mom be like why is she sitting in her room and then they, like they crack a joke and do like why is she sitting in her room I just don't be wanting to be bothered like I be just wondering like if my daddy would say like what type of bone we have and I sometimes I see my friends with they dead and stuff like that and it just make me cry like cause I get a tear, but then I like I go down like this to wipe my tear. Anybody like anybody that bring up my dead name, I always a cry and get emotional. I don't know why. It's just a natural thing for me. Um, it's hard. I'm not gonna cry. I'm gonna be strong in this video. Okay, I'm gonna be strong because I know that I cry every day about him, and I just wish that they never happen. But that's how I truly fit. I'm heartbroken, y'all. Like, y'all understand. Like, I told y'all that I won't go cry. Like, anytime I talk about this, I always cry and I always get tears in my ass. But I'm heartbroken. Like, I'm heartbroken. Like, you want then you are like, this me. First of all, I'm a, like, I'm working on like me controlling my emotions. Like, I'm just trying. Like, it's still hard. I still didn't heal. From what happened 10 years ago um, for the people that don't know um oh guys this is so hard for me to talk about <sighs> this is so hard for me to talk about nobody don't understand everybody just think this is a joke and this is real life y'all sitting here watching me this is real life i just want to tell y'all that this is real life like this is how i feel um, I feel like crying right now, <laughs> but you know, I'm just I just want to stay strong. Like I know that he want me to stay strong, and I just want to hear his voicemail. I remember like I'm just gonna take, put put this in. I remember I used to call his phone just to, like hear his voicemail, and I'm not even gonna say I forgot my day number. No, this is not right. This is not the right video. Okay. Basically, he had a voicemail, like I said, and I used to call it just to hear his voice. Um, I can't do it no more. Last time I did that, I think it was like five years ago. He was had his phone, and I used to call it all the time, like, just to hear his voice. I just wish I could hear his voice. I wish I could just tell him. I actually wish I had the phone where I could talk to him. That's how I truly feel. And... It's just hard for me, y'all. Like, y'all understand. Like, it's hard. I lost my daddy at a young age. And one person I really have is mom. And that's my best friend. And, like, I don't know what I would do without my mama. Yeah, I'm just emotional because, like, don't nobody know what I go through. Everybody think, oh, I'm just this perfect Shayla. Oh, your life's so perfect. It's not, y'all. It's not. And I don't want to cry, so. Oh, I'm crying. What? Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm so sorry for crying. I just always get emotional when I talk about this. I like, I try to like not cry and stuff like that. If you get what I'm saying, but it always come out like it always come out. I'm so sorry for crying, y'all. Y'all don't mind my, do not mind my hair, y'all, cause like y'all see these curls, like it's poofing up. It looks so bad. But I'm not gonna really try to make this video long. Um. This is all I really want to say. I really like. It's more to the story, like how I really feel. But if y'all want to see that, comment down below for a part two. Like, yeah. But guys, if you like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post bell notification to get notified every time I post. And your girl is out.